The jungle of Brazil is probably the last place you'd expect to find an unusual theater. But in the middle of the jungle, we find the city of Manaus. And in the middle of Manaus, the magnificent Teatro Amazona, theater of the Amazons. This exquisite theater was constructed at the turn of the century, when the rubber boom made Manaus Brazil's wealthiest city. Caruso sang on this stage, as did many of the most famous stars of the day. And so, it would be an honor for anyone to get the chance to do the same. always so slow and easy in the perpetual summertime you find in Manaus. This was once a very busy city. When the theater was finished in 1896, this tropical town had been turned into a showpiece for European culture. The theater is a product of a time when people had money to spend, when the wealth of the rubber market supported a vigorous trade in hard currencies, diamonds and gold. Inside the theater, wealth is turned into ornate beauty, ironwork from Scotland. Chandeliers from Italy, a painted ceiling from France. All of it hauled up the river and assembled for the entertainment of the rich. When the rubber boom collapsed after 1910, the wealth of Manaus evaporated, and the city today is a far cry from what it used to be. Teatro Amazonas is still in use for modern performances, but in our brief engagement, we perform for the ghosts of the past. Amazonas is a beautiful monument to a time when wealth and splendor made a brief visit into the heart of the jungle, a most unusual theater. We've reserved a seat here because you asked for it. <laughs> 